Hi guys, welcome back or welcome if you are new here. My name is Hannah. I'm currently a stay-at-home mum to two children, a two-year-old little girl and a one-year-old little boy. Things are going to change in a few days. I will let you guys know after it happens. Don't want to jinx myself because that seemed to have happened last time. I tend to jinx myself when I say things. Anyway, today's shop is a food shop. Um, I know I've just done a Tesco's one, but that was recorded like last Friday. Um, yes, so I went somewhere different today. I went to the food warehouse by Iceland. I did used to work there actually, in the same one I went to. Um, because my brother currently works there and it was 20% off. So I thought, you know what, for a change, we are going to go there. So originally it all came to 154.86, but then after all the discounts, like the two for four pounds and the two for five pounds, uh, three for three pounds, things like that. Um, and obviously Bradley's discount, it came down to 111 pounds and 95 pence. So that's like what, 142 pounds and some change in savings, which is a bargain if you ask me. Oh, there it is. £42.91. pence. Wonderful. Right, to begin with, Isabella saw this and fell in love with it. This was £8. If I can remember how much things were, I will let you guys know. If not, I will pop it in the corner like I always do. Um, but yeah, these are £8. They light up. I don't know if you can see, but they light up. So Isabella loves that. Oh, actually, while we're here, we also popped into Matalan just to see what they had. And they had these... They didn't have, I think that's Riley waking up. That's Riley waking up, it's fine. Um, we popped into Matalan just to see if they had any like, bargains. And they had these, these were originally 12 or 13 pounds, I think, and they were down to six pounds. And they like, light up, if you can see. So um, we picked them up for Isabella because they didn't really have any girly ones in her size, but she liked these because she likes Toy Story. Um, and once they're too big for her, her brother can have them. Anyway, going back to Iceland. Trying to keep a bit quiet because the kid's napping upstairs. I don't know if he's going to get Riley back down or if he's going to bring him down. Um, right. First things first, I picked up these two steak and kidney chip shop pies. They were £2.40 down to £1.20. I'm going to have to be a little bit quiet. So I think there, he's fallen back asleep, so that's fine. I'm just close on the way some British Gala apples these were in the three for five pounds so I think I did that offer twice with the fruit um, got a big bag of crinkle cut chips these were two pounds this mayonnaise at uh, mayonnaise salad cream was like one pound 39 one pound 69 something like that so I thought we'd pick that up and give that a go Yorkshire puddings, these are like £1.25 I think for the 16 of them. Uh, I picked up the orange one, smoothie mix. These were two for £4. If I pick that one up, and there's another one in here somewhere, I'll show you when I get to it. Um, I did the three for £5 with the yoghurt, so I picked up some chocolate trifles. Again, once I get to the things, I'll tell you what were included in the three for five pounds. Um, I just picked up two pepperoni pizzas because these were a pound each. So they're just a good freezer stocking, stocker. The whole reason why we really went to Iceland is because we wanted to just stock the freezer up a little bit because whatever we bought the other day, he's still very sleepy, bless him. He's not very happy. Um, what we bought the other day is Oh, the other month, should I say, is basically gone. So I'm trying to just stock it up just a little bit. Um, also got some of these strawberry milkshakes. They were a pound. Some butter was one twenty-five. Some little hot dogs. These were a pound a, a jar. These Swedish-style meatballs. I just thought we'd give them a go. I always see, like, is it... 
Sam from Grab Life by the Halls. She always buys these sort of things and says they're really nice, so I thought we'd give them a go. Got the kids some zoo animals, potato shapes, just anything that will help Isabella just eat a little bit more because she's just not interested in anything at the minute. Um, eight chicken breast, uh, chicken, chicken breast breast steaks. they were like three pounds i think two pound fifty something like that um and i picked these up these were like four pound fifty i want to say for 20 american patties so that's that bag done give me a oh jesus christ moving on um i picked these up these were like 169 i think this was a big buy, but we have so much bacon. This was £12 for, <laughs> not happy, bless him. He's still very tired. For two kg worth of bacon, £12. That's not too bad, I don't think. Um, we like portion it up into like six, maybe nine portions and throw it in the freezer. And it is good to go. This was £2.50, I just thought, I fancied it and I wanted it so I picked it up um, these were also in the two for five pounds um, these were like 180 each I think these used to, when I used to work there these used to be a pound maybe even 95p because I remember me and my brother like worked there at the same time and um, he used to always buy these so it's just but yeah these were in the three for five pounds Uh, these were free for five pounds as well as you can as you can tell so 26 vegetable samosas again just like stocking up the freezer um this was a pound this smoked pork sausage it's only 130 grams it's definitely not very big but um that's riley and jamie obviously it's not riley by himself um but for a pound i thought it would be fine uh, obviously isabella had to get her squishy clouds uh, I've got some sudden fried wedges. I think these were like £2.75, I think. It's a massive bag. It's 1.25 kg. And this was the other smoothie mix that was in the two for £4. This is just a banana and strawberry one. These, again, were in the three for £5. Some vegetable spring rolls. And I got these goujons as well. There's 25 chicken goujons in there. They were also in that frozen freezer five. I got myself a deodorant just because I couldn't remember if I had any. So that's like 125, I think. Um, these bananas were also in the three for five pounds, so I just picked them up. And these easy peelers were in the three for five pounds, so I picked them up as well. Got some milk. This is like two pounds thirty now, something like that. These uh, chicken satays, I'm pretty certain these are in two for three for five pounds. Yeah, these were three. Right. These, I think, were two pounds, two pounds seventy-five. Can't remember. I'll put somewhere. This massive bag of chicken nuggets, because if you have a young child, you know you have to have chicken nuggets. This is 1.62 kg. 90 chicken breast dippers. I can't remember how much they were off the top of my head. And I got myself some of these for £2.50. But like I say, you got to remember, every price I give you, I got 20% off of that, obviously, with my brother's discount card. Right. Moving up. I picked up some more bottles of the bubbles. This was a pound, so it made like 80p. <sighs> she goes through so many of these. I literally try and leave them like mums, my brothers, here. So everywhere she goes, she's got bubbles to play with when we go outside. Um, again, a bubble, bubble sword. I've always called it a bubble wand, but that was a pound as well. Um, these were also three for a fiver. So blueberries, raspberries, and red grapes. Red seedless grapes. I'm glad they're seedless. I didn't check. So that's 
good. Um, this was also in the three for five pounds with the yogurt. Use that bacon out of the way. This was in the three for five pounds with the other with the satays, and they did have like little chicken balls, but we ate them in the shop. This was a pound for two garlic baguettes. These were like £2.75, I think. I mean, it's expensive for uh, 700 grams of chips, but I like them, so. Um, this is really nice, this sub steak. The only issue is, is they like stick together all the bits of um, steak. So like, I can buy, I can eat them. Oh, there we go, yeah, so like all the, oh, it doesn't look very appetizing there, but all these like little slices stick together. It's a pain in the ass, but it's fine. Um, Got some 28 breaded fish fingers. These were like £2.35, I think. These are £2. These ham wedge, cheesy ham wedge. I just thought, just for something different, just for something easy. Um, these giant strawberries were also a pound. These were like £5, I think. 40 pork sausages. I, mean, I think they're just normal. Yeah, they're just normal sausage size. So. Nothing exciting about them. Also, pick these up. These were like a fiver, I think. No, five seventy-five. These were. These used to be five pounds when I was there again, but they're five seventy-five now. And the last thing in this bag is just some cheese stuffed pizzas. I got. A Double pepperoni with cheese stuffed crust and a barbecue chicken and bacon with cheese stuffed crust. These were two for five pounds. Again, they used to be like two pounds each when I worked there, but that was a long time ago when I last worked there. So, right, moving on. This is all like the cakes and bread and stuff. Um, these were also three for three for three pounds three for five pounds i want to say three for three and um, so we picked up these choco latte things these were also in the three for three pounds jamie likes them um these were like one pound 30 each i think so they worked out just over a pound with the discount so can't complain at that when they're like 125 everywhere else both my kids like them so um some seeded burger buns these are two pounds they've always been two pounds and this was the other thing in the three for three pounds just chocolate jumbo swiss roll chocolate and vanilla yeah um these were in three for three pounds as well so i picked up a pack of the croissants just to make it easy for breakfast because you know like if you just want to go out somewhere for the day and whatever you just want an easy breakfast or like when we go to a car boot on a sunday just something easy just to throw in the bag the kids can eat in the car or while we're there or whatever so i've got some pan of chocolates i've got two pan of chocolates got some reduced white finger rolls these were down from 75p to 45p some eggs these were 1.99 i believe they are all still good, so that's fine. I'm just pop them on there. And then the last things that we got were just three loaves of this bread that was down from a pound to 60p. It's just the thick white sliced bread by Iceland. And that is the last of it. I mean, when I look at it like this, it doesn't look like very much for... I mean, originally it was like, what, 150... 154 pounds and 86 pence then obviously you had your three for twos and three for fives and three for threes and two for fives and two for fours and everything else so yes that wasn't too bad i don't think it will do us and it'll fill the freezer up a little bit um right oh also guys look look at my new ring it's adorable isn't it we went and picked it up on fry no, Tuesday, Wednesday, 
Wednesday. Tu when did we go? Tuesday. Tu Tuesday. It was Tuesday we went and picked it up because it is, yeah, yeah, Tuesday we went and got it. We went to this massive soft play with my brother and his partner and my kids and Jamie and whatever. Um, and then I got the text saying that the ring was ready. Obviously, I um, I got a new engagement ring and a new, obviously, our wedding band. I got a bridal set. So, uh, yes, guys. Um, also, I have a vintage now. If you guys are interested, I'm still used to getting used to it. I've sold a few things. Um, I'm still trying to, like, understand it all and things like that. But my... Vinted is, if you're interested, it is. Let's see if I can make it bigger for you. I don't think I can. Hmm. Hang on, let me. Will it get brighter? Let's see. Can you see? Hannah Cross. Hannah Cross 24. If you're interested. Um, yeah, I've just got a few things up there, and I am always like looking through the house, seeing what else I can pop up there. Um, and yeah, and as always, if you're fancy following my Instagram, I will pop it here, here, wherever. I'll pop it somewhere. Uh, it is all lower caps, Hannah underscore cross underscore 24. Uh, no, Hannah underscore cross underscore 19. It's not 24, 24 is vintage, 19 for Instagram. Um, Yes, so I hope you have enjoyed today's video, guys. I did have someone comment seeing if I could go to Asda. I'm probably going to go to Asda next week just for a change, just to keep keep that that lady happy. Um, just for a comparison, I mean, it makes sense why she's asked for it. I mean, so I feel like doing it and just seeing how it compares to the other shops and things like that. If there is any other shops, let me know, guys, and I will definitely be down for doing that. And uh, yeah guys. I hope you've enjoyed today's video and until next time. Bye.